Hi everyone! Um, we're just going to wait a few seconds to see um, if anyone else joins us this morning um, and then I'm going to give you a little bit of an overview of what you can expect um, from our virtual open day that's coming up next month. Okay, so, um, hi, I'm Alex. I'm the marketing manager here at Brooksby Melton College. I also look after the admissions team as well. And today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the virtual open day that we have coming up at the end of next month. Um, the event is due to take place on Saturday the 20th of June from 10am. Um, if you haven't registered already, it's super easy to do. Um, just visit our website and you'll see a big banner on the homepage that will point you in the right direction. Um, but we'll also publish a link at the end of this video as well. Um, and there's one in the description. So, um, for those of you that have been to one of our open events before, you'll know how important they are to us. It's often the first time that we get to meet our students, and for you guys it's a great opportunity to see what makes us special as well. Um, so what we hope to achieve from the virtual open day next month is a similar feel to that, and we hope to provide you with all the information, advice and guidance that you require. Um, but most importantly, at the end of the event, I hope that you'll see what we feel makes us really special and that's our staff and um, they've gone above and beyond to prepare some really fun um, activities for you to do on the day and um, some virtual tours some really great presentations about what our courses entail as well um, so ultimately hopefully this will give you a really good insight into what it's like to be a student at BMC so um, I want to say a really big thank you to everyone who's registered so far and we've had lots of registrations, they're coming in thick and fast so it's a really good indication that um, this open event is what you guys really need and um, it's a very difficult time at the moment so um, hopefully this will bring us all together. Um, we've had a few questions sent in to us so I'm going to cover those this morning um, so that if you haven't signed up yet or you're not sure what to expect hopefully this will help. Um, if you have any more questions while I'm talking about the virtual open day, my colleague Meg is going to be watching and she will answer any questions that you've got in the comments. Um, so give us a like, um, put a comment to say hi, it's great to see who's with us today. Um, and now we'll crack on with some questions. So will there be staff available to talk to? Yes, um, we'll have a number of ways you can get in touch with staff on the day. Um, the main way to do this will be through the live Q&A sessions that we're running for each course area. Um, a timetable of these will be published soon, but essentially you'll be able to join in with a virtual conversation, um, very similar to what you would at a, a normal open day, um, just with team members from the course that you're interested in. Um, so whether you want to ask them about what kit is required, or a particular module, or which level will be most suitable for you, this would be the perfect opportunity to do that. However, if you miss the live Q&A for your course, or if you have a question that you think would be better asked a bit more privately, um, our teams will also be available via email and social media throughout the day as well. Um, so you can send in those questions to us and we'll forward them on to the team. Um, we'll also have members from our student support teams there as well, just like we would at a normal open day. So people like transport, accommodation, student services, additional learning support, those sort of teams, um, they'll all be available to answer your questions as well. So next question, uh, do I have to be online for the whole time from 10 to 1? No, no, you're welcome to spend as much or a little, a little as time as you need to with us on the day. Um, the virtual open day will officially start from 10 and this is when you'll be able to access some exclusive content on our website. Um, this is also when the live Q&As will start for each course area. So you can come and go as you please. Um, if you want to come back later on for a live Q&A for your course area, this is fine. Um, you don't have to wait around if you don't want to, but there will be lots and lots of content to keep you busy. Um, and as I said, we'll all be available to ask questions too as well. Will I be able to see the campus? Um, well, this is obviously slightly difficult at the moment. Um, however, we have been able to put together some videos, um, some virtual tours of the facilities, um, using the resources that we've been able to safely access during this lockdown period. Um, so hopefully this will give you a good idea of what 
our campuses look and feel like. So the social areas, the areas that you'll be studying in, um, hopefully this will give you a good idea of what it will be like to study here. I can't make the main event. Will the videos be available afterwards? Yes, absolutely. Um, if you can't make that date, don't worry. All the content we show during the event will be available on our website afterwards um, and we'll put up loads of posts pointing you in the right direction as well. Um, also, um, if this event goes well, we probably will do another virtual open event later on in the summer or a physical open event um, if possible. It obviously just depends on what happens with the lockdown measures. Um, however, if you are hoping to start a course this September, um, then I would rec wouldn't recommend waiting until the next open event to apply. We are getting to the point of the year now where some of the courses are starting to fill up. So I would recommend getting your application in as soon as possible so we can get an interview arranged to avoid any disappointment. Will I be able to apply on the day? Absolutely, there will be a presentation for you to watch for our admissions team, from our admissions team. So if you have any questions about the process, hopefully this will help. Um, otherwise, the admissions team will be available via email and social media throughout the morning. Um, so they'll be able to help you with your application. Um, you can apply for a course at any time via our website. You don't have to wait for a virtual open day or a normal open day. Um, but if you do choose to apply during the event, um, we'll start the process, um, getting your application processed um, there and then. And you'll receive an invitation to an interview within a matter of days. So, how do I register for the virtual open day? Good question. Um, so to register, all you have to do is visit www.brooksbymelton.ac.uk forward slash events. And here you'll see a list of four virtual open events taking place on Saturday the 20th of June. So I'm just going to explain those a little bit so um, it's not confusing. Um, there's a choice of College Virtual Open Day Brooksby Campus, College Virtual Open Day Melton Campus, Undergraduate Virtual Open Day Brooksby Campus and Undergraduate Virtual Open Day Melton Campus. So if you're interested in studying a degree with us either from this September or in the future, you need to sign up for one of the undergraduate events. For any other levels though, um, you should head to the college virtual open days. Um, if you select a particular campus and can't see the course that you're looking for, it's likely that that's because it's hosted at the other campus. Um, so you just need to switch over to the other event. Um, don't worry too much though if you sign up for the wrong event. Um, you'll still be able to access all the courses on the day. It just means that we'll point you in the right direction to begin with. Um, once you've filled out the short form to register, you'll receive a confirmation message and then near the time we'll email you with some more information on how to access the event on the day. So that's covered all the main inquiries that we've had. Um, if you think of any others um, that you want to ask after we finish this video, please don't hesitate to get in touch with us. Um, you'll probably know already that we're really active on social media, so you can message us through those channels at any time. Um, and you can also send an email to events at brooksbymelton.ac.uk and we'll get back to you really quickly. Um, thank you again to everyone who's joined me this morning. Um, it's really great to see so many people online um, and we will see you for the event on Saturday the 20th of June. Thank you. <laughs>